Paul Johnson is the Surprise Fire Medical Department Paramedic of the Year. Surprised. Um, there's a lot of great competition. <laughs> I work with some fantastic, fantastic paramedics. Battalion Chief Larry Suburvi has a different take. Well, I would say if you went statistically with 100 paramedics and only one wins it a year, you have a 1% chance of winning it, right? So um, that would be if everybody was equal. Paul's just not equal to everybody else. He's on a different level as, as a medic. The timing of this award makes it all the more meaningful to Paul and his family. Due to his health, he's currently on disability. So I went from not having cancer to stage four cancer. It happened fast. Paul first noticed something was wrong in April. He says he didn't quite feel like himself and had some stomach pain. I'd be full after four or five bites, which isn't like me. So he went to the ER and eventually learned he has esophageal cancer that metastasized to his liver. Not much one to cry, but I got a little teary. It's just things were racing through my head, like mortgages and bills and, and you know, dealing with my, my children who are 11, uh, 9, and 6, that, you know, we've got big news and life's going to change. Now, Paul gets all his nutrients through a feeding tube since he can't eat, and he's undergoing chemotherapy. The fire department has been offering an outpouring of support with meals for his family, rides to doctor's appointments, and even help with landscaping. It means that I have support, and there's reasons for me to be here. And Paul is one of those paramedics that you would want taking care of your family. Paul was nominated by his peers and selected by a panel to be paramedic of the year before his diagnosis. It's a touching tribute to his years of dedication spent serving and saving others. His recognition for today has nothing to do with his diagnosis, has everything to do with who he was already. It means the world. Paul tells me his goal is to go back to work as soon as he can. If you'd like to help this family as he battles this difficult diagnosis, we have a link to a fundraiser on our website.